I don't know if it's going. It's not saying. There it is. Okay. Hey, everybody. It is Margaret, and welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures. Uh, tonight, I thought I would jump on just for a bit live and share some of my favorite reseller and merch YouTube channels um, that I've been watching lately. Uh, some are tried and true, and I've been watching them for a long time, and some are a bit newer. Uh, so I thought I would share some of those with you. Now, this is by no means all of the ones that I watch, but some of my kind of go-to, like if I'm looking for information about certain things or people that are pretty reliable over <laughs> over the time, over the long term. And I am live, so I will say hi to people in the chat too. So hello, Phyllis, and hello, Greg, the Valley Pickers here. Hello, hello. So my main thing when I go to watch YouTubers is I look for no drama, basically. It's like, I have enough drama in my real life that I don't, this is why I don't watch TV very much because like, it stresses me out. So most of the people that I will share are generally no drama people. So now that is not to say that, that there are people that have, I don't know, it sounds weird, that kind of get into some of the drama stuff that are not fun to watch also, but these generally that I'm going to share are not drama. <laughs> I don't get into it, if that makes sense. Some people love the drama, don't get me wrong. I mean, some people love to watch, <laughs> you know, it's like reality TV. So anyway, but that being said, let's share some of my favorite. And if you're watching later um, or you're watching in the chat, share some of your favorites because I am always looking for new YouTubers to watch and I try to follow and encourage new YouTubers as well. So and apologies if I miss anybody and I'm sure I will. I'm gonna miss lots of people. So here we go. So sharing over here. Let me see. Okay, chat's going. Hello. Yeah, Valley Pick. And again, if you see friends in the chat here, these are all amazing people. You can go over and click on their names and, and follow them. So hello. Oh, Cindy, you changed your name. Cindy loves jewelry. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Hey, Swag Maven. Hello, Angela. Hello, Maggie C Magic City Kitty. Oh, hello, hello. Okay, I'm scooching it up so we can see everybody. Okay, so one of my, of course, my husband's phone is going off in there. <laughs> and if you've been, I, I haven't put up a lot in lately because my kids have been sick. They're still kind of sick, but I wanted to come. Anyway, all right, so the first couple are just like all around. I enjoy watching them all the time. They are great YouTubers. Um, this is Mom the eBayer, if you don't watch her. She does a lot of dumpster diving. She's got amazing attitude. And so she is somebody to definitely watch. So, oh, I lost my other, here we go. So Mom the eBayer is one that's just like an all around I enjoy watching. And next is Taco Stacks. Uh, he has a lot of really fun stuff, trash finds, and he did this uh, storage auction and was going through the storage locker. And So he's another one I enjoy watching a lot. These are just kind of, again, I have some that I'm going to dive deeper into, like uh, if I'm looking for a toy, somebody to help me with toys, this is who I go to, you know, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, I think you can do that, Phyllis says. Yeah, isn't she great, Sunny? Uh, Marcus, Dempster Marcus, I think he's got a giveaway going on too right now. Yep, 10,000 subscriber giveaway. So go over there and follow Marcus and enter his giveaway. Um, he's another one that's just such a positive guy and puts out a great videos. So he's so much fun to watch. Uh, and then another one that I really enjoy watching is the bin pickers. I don't go to the bins. We don't have bins here. But it's sort of like I get to live vicariously through them and their their bin pickings. Um, Cindy says she watched Taco Stack several times today. That's cool. Oh, look, Jeff's there. He's here to troll me. <laughs> That's good. I haven't, yeah. <laughs> okay, so now my go-to's for jewelry, and I didn't get to add Cindy on there, but Cindy just started her channel. Cindy, you can see her down there. Cindy loves jewelry. She's been sharing some of her jewelry. Oh, yeah, Scavenger Life. I didn't add them on here. They're, they're just like the overall, I mean, they're so good, right? Scavenger Life is another one I didn't put on here, but you're right. They're so good. Okay, so when I'm looking for jewelry, like jewelry hauls to watch and things like that, I, I love Princess Casserole's videos and haul videos. Um, also, Makeup Zombie, if you don't watch her, she puts out some good jewelry and jarrings. And again, apologies if I, 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 if I don't share everybody. It's not, yeah, anyway. And then Thelma. Thelma's been putting out some really good jewelry videos also, Thelma Thrift. And she, some of our friends are going to show up twice. <laughs> no favoritism here, right? 
But, okay, so those are my go-tos generally when I'm looking for, when they put out new jewelry videos I watch. Cindy's just started, Cindy in the chat, Cindy Loves Jewelry has just started putting out some. So definitely check them out. Um, also, let's see if I put Karen on here. Um, Karen is another one that I like to watch for jewelry, but she also puts out things like um, vintage jewelry hauls and like vintage collectibles and things like that. So she always, um, <clears throat> pardon me, she puts out some really good videos as well as well. <coughs> Pardon me, sorry. I just ate some pecans. <laughs> <coughs> yep, yep. Sorry, Jeff. Well, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. I had some pecans, so you know how it happens. Anyway, Karen finds some really cute stuff and interesting things as well. So I look for that, not just the everyday kind of things, right? So, um, and there was somebody else too. Now it's just left my brain. There, were, there was somebody else that was really into vintage joy, and I can't think of who it was. Okay, so when I want to find out more about toys, now some of these are my UK friends. If you don't watch Ben Fitzpatrick, I love him. Um, yeah. Anyway, so Ben Ben Fitzpatrick, he does lots of videos about toys and things like that. Uh, he's a UK reseller, and then another friend that knows a lot about toys and some other things and some other things is my friend Chris at Thrift Shop Hustler so definitely check them out. Uh, Cindy says oh you got your favorite list Karen right? She's so and that's the thing like I just attitude is everything so I love the the positive attitude you 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 get what you what you see is what you get kind of deal right? Um, yeah, Debbie says, I need to stop watching TV at night when I'm exhausted watch YouTubers. Yeah, I know, I, and I don't watch very much TV at all. Sometimes I'll watch some stuff. Okay, so those are my guys that I go to when I'm um, looking for toys or if I need information about toys or things like that. Um, and Chris has been helping me, helping me a lot with my Star Wars, my vintage Star Wars and G.I. Joe haul that I just got, so he's been really helpful. Um, okay, so when it comes to merch and men's did I put merch on here twice okay men's shoes and merch I have hustler hacks on here so um, Glenn who is a super amazing nice guy he's probably one of the nicest guys I've ever met <laughs> so if you don't watch Glenn hustler hacks um, he does a lot of stuff with um, merch and he also goes in like Ross and flips shoes like men's sneakers and things like that so he's really a great one to watch as well so let's see. So another uh, another few people that I really enjoy watching for like collectibles and not just your average everyday kind of hauls, but like when they find really cool stuff, vintage stuff, just yeah, any kind of cool stuff like that, fun hauls, um, is Jen Pudgy Picker, and Thrifting 101 is one that I enjoy watching a lot. I learn a lot about glassware and things like that from. Thrifting 101. And then also Terminal 99 has started putting out videos again. Uh, he had stopped for a little while, but he, he finds some really cool things. Craig is, oh yeah, yeah, there's some good ones in the chat too. And again, if you're watching later, leave comments about some of your favorites. I can't, I couldn't put everybody, you know, but these are some of my favorites. Um, you met him in person in Phoenix. Who is that? Um, G Jess, I was at Glenn or somebody else. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, again, I I'm not really into. Oh, forget Jeff. Let's just not talk about him. <laughs> um, we'll get back to Jeff in a minute, right? Where did where did Bitcoin go? <laughs> so another one I put on here for like if you're interested in learning more about Bitcoin or Steam it or alternative currencies. And Jeff like lovingly calls Chris Bitcoin because he does a lot of videos about Bitcoin and things like that. Yeah, Glenn is super nice, right? Um, then he, Chris is another one to watch. Um, I've been watching more of, of, of Rockstar Flipper too. So I, yeah. All right, Jeff, I guess I'll give him props, whatever. Um, so Jeff has been doing a lot more videos about helping with Printful, but not just Printful. But he's definitely somebody I go to if I need help with um, setting up like my website, or if I were wanting if I were wanting to sell on my own website, he would be the guy I would go to ask because he definitely sells a lot, uh, has his own website, so he's on lots of different platforms selling his print-on-demand stuff. 
Um, so he would be my go-to for that. And when I was setting up my website, not to sell on, he got to see me cry a lot. <laughs> so definitely go over there and watch him. And he's been doing some other stuff too, some aquaponics. And I don't know if you're sharing your aquaponics on here. I don't think you are. Anyway, you've been putting out more videos. Good job, Jeff. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, okay. And then, so when it comes to merch stuff, because I'm a mercher, you know, print on demand, and I watch The Treasure now. This is Mike Peterson, and he hasn't been putting out as many lately. When was the last time you put out of it? Three months ago. Oh, my gosh. But he's always been there when I had questions, when I needed help, when, you know, he was, he's always giving me really great advice. So um, Mike, The Treasure now, and he still has great videos. He's actually the one that, when I was learning about um, Adobe Illustrator, which was my big fear, uh, he, he, I took his Udemy course, which I can't say enough about because it really got me past my wall. Um, let's see, Resell Rabbit. Oh, yeah, yeah, Resell Rabbit. I met him. Look at what? Uh, yeah, yeah, it wasn't you. Sorry, honey. <laughs> my husband tried to teach me. Not so good. <laughs> it didn't go so well. Um, okay, and then so another merch person that, look, he only has 240 subscribers, y'all. We got to fix this. Nick Eden, he has a podcast, a 4554 podcast, and then he's been doing these merch in a minute vlogs. Um, and so he's, and he's been on a couple times with Merch Talk. So he's, and he's a really great guy. So definitely go check out Nick Eden as well. Let's see. <laughs> I'm looking in the chat real quick, see if I'm missing anything. Yeah, and you know, I didn't add Casey on here. I do watch him, though. Is that weird? I should have added him on here. <laughs> Sorry, Casey, if you're watching. <laughs> All right, next. Um, another mercher is my buddy Joe, Merch University. And he's definitely stepping up his YouTube game. Uh, and he's the he's over the Merch University Facebook group, too. Hello, hello. Let's see. <laughs> Thanks, G. Jessup. I, I've gotten better at it. I'm not quite as scared of it, but yeah. Mm. <laughs> it took some doing, for sure. Okay, so then, okay, these these two, Caroline is my good friend, so I always watch Caroline's videos. Uh, and she puts out all kinds of eBay stuff, vlogs, and everything, but it's just sort of, you've, and, and, oh, I forgot to mention this. Somewhere up here, I put a poll. I don't know if it's going to render until after the video or now. But I have a poll that I put up there. Like, what what do you watch YouTube for? Like, what are your go-to? Like, you watch for entertainment? Do you watch for education? Um, or do you watch for, like, being social, like a community setting or just some other reason? So I kind of go for all of those things. And because Caroline is my friend, I, I watch her and it, and it just, you know, feels like I'm watching a friend because I am. <laughs> so that's one of my go-tos as well. And then also Carla has been making videos. Y'all, if you don't watch Carla, she cracks me up. Like if I need a laugh, I will come watch Carla. She's a UK reseller. And there, were, there have been some where Carla and uh, Caroline get together and talk and it is... It is hilarious and sometimes inappropriate, but hilarious. <laughs> so, um, yeah, go check out Carla Jenkins as well. She's really funny. Um, and then, okay, when I want to learn or if I, if I want to learn about jeans or clothes or if I had any questions, these are the people I would go to for jeans, clothes, which at the moment I don't because I have no interest in that. But if I needed to, these are the people. I still watch them, though, so I don't know. Um, so Prof Sales and Karin, um, Karin's channel is just us Karin, I think, but I didn't put it on here. Um, so yeah, Jason at Prof Sales and then Lindy, who's amazing and sweet, puts out lots of really good videos and super motivational, just kind of pushing you, you know, to get through it, you know? Oh, cool. That's a, that's a good one, Jay. Oh, okay. I'm just going to call you Jasset. Okay. Uh, channel about tips and tricks about cleaning your thrifted items on a budget. That's not, that would be a good idea, yeah. Let's see. The storage locker one. Awesome. Okay, I'm looking. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Uh, and then also for clothes is Rad Seller Gina, who's another really sweet girl. And, you know, I was doing these mompreneur interviews a while back, and just everything exploded in my life. 
and I didn't get to, and she was she was next, and we'd even been talking about when are we gonna do this? She's busy, I'm busy, and then it just kind of like, ah, it didn't happen. So yeah, are there any YouTubers that do regular auctions? Um, I've done some online ones, and you know what? Some of the UK resellers do more auctions, like. I think Nick and Andrea go to some auctions, and Sahir, I think they might. Um, <laughs> I'm looking again. Da, 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 da. Okay, so those are the clothes, or if I'm looking for somebody. Okay, now, this guy really needs some help. He's, he, we, we need to like get his channel going because he just can't get enough subscribers. Um, so... My, these next two are people that I go to for motivation or if I feel like, I don't know. So Steve, uh, Steve is actually the reason I got started on YouTube. I mean, he, he I mean, we actually had a phone call. I mean, I've met him many, many times since then, personally, in person. But his just like his story and his, his drive and his push and I don't know. Anyway, so when I need motivation, he's one of my go-tos for sure. Um, Steve, and then also Nick and Andrea. So Nick and Andrea Hill is another UK resellers. <clears throat> Pardon me. Uh, again, just they have an amazing story and just the, I guess it's the drive, you know what I mean? Like, so what I see in common is like Steve and then Nick and Andrea, they, they always strive to do better. They always strive to improve, to and they keep, it's like they're, they keep their eye on the prize. Like what's important in life, you know, having a good life. It's not just making money, but yeah, we're going to make money. We're going to meet our goals financially. We're going to meet our goals um, with Steve, you know, like health wise. And anyway, so these, I don't know how else to describe it, like professionalism and just, yeah. Anyway, so those are some really good ones as well. Um. Next, if I had questions about RC stuff, radio control, cars or planes or whatever, trains, I guess there's RC train. I don't know. Um, I would definitely talk to Zaheer. So go check out Zaheer Malik. And then Chris Thrift Shop. No, not Chris. It was Bonafide Hustler. That's who I put on here. Um, so Chris Bonafide Hustler and Zaheer are both the two people I know that know stuff about RC stuff. So if I needed any info about RC, those are the people I would go talk to for sure. And Chris is always just fun to watch <laughs> too. So um, yeah, again, he always puts out really good content. So, uh-oh, I gotta, is he okay? I think somebody got hurt over there. Um, okay, my next one, <laughs> Steve is an OG, yeah he is. All right, so my next one is is Dorky Thrifters. I love watching Becky. They are resellers that are in an RV, full time resellers, and she so she's got to do it small and she's got to make a profit. And she does a lot with um, glasses, eyewear, and things like that. So if I had questions about eyewear, which can bring a lot of money, um, she's she's my go to for that. Like how to take care of them, clean them, sell them. What's worth money what's worth because you know you go to the thrift store and you see a basket full of old eyeglasses and dirty yucky you know and you want to pull out a sixty dollar bill she's the one that you would want to talk to about that um oh hey leanne wilson from new zealand let's see butterfly's buff yeah he is he really is <laughs> um, if you watch him or if you follow him on uh instagram you'll see that too okay then uh, Thelma makes the list again because whenever I come across brands that I need to know, like is this real? Is this fake? Look at this purse. Um, she she knows her stuff when it comes to like Louis Vuitton and things like that. You find these bags all the time, or you you'll wonder, you know, is this real? What was it that I found? It was a wallet. I can't remember now what, what kind of wallet it was, but was it anyway? She was my go-to for you know. Is this authentic or not? And she's able to, to help out with that kind of stuff. And then, finally, is this my last one? I think so. Is my friend Jason. Um, Jason is, he's definitely my go-to for, he knows music, backwards and frontwards. Um, tiki, obviously, he's super into Tiki. But another thing I really enjoy about Jason, or if I need 
he knows everybody, right? So if I am like, dude, I found this really obscure whatever, he'll say, oh, you know what? So-and-so knows about this. Here, talk to so-and-so. You know, like, so he, if he doesn't know, he knows someone who knows, if that makes sense. So that, and, and he's just a really good friend. He's one of those friends yeah. that's always got your back. So I appreciate that. So <laughs> that's, yeah, he, he totally does. He gives that, and his, you know, anyway, his mom's great. It's awesome. It's awesome. Awesome. And I'm sure, I know I missed multitudinous YouTubers, and it is in no way a reflection on whether I like them or not. But I had to just kind of, I tried to narrow it down, and I tried to see, like, who is my go-to for different topics. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, for sure. So I'm looking in the chat. So definitely, if you've got other people that you enjoy watching, leave a comment in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear, see, I mean, there's, I'm trying to think off the top of my head. There's so many new ones that are out there, and I'm interested in, in watching them for sure. Stephen Steven, yeah, Rally Roots is another one. They're not super new, but like Law School Thrifter. I'm trying to think who else just off the top of my head. But that's the thing, yeah, Th Tiff's Thrifts is saying, my current faves are them, they're so positive and generous. That's that's kind of like positivity and you can tell when there's somebody's like, they're, that, they are who they are, right? They're not like, anyway. So, <laughs> that's important. Yeah, anyway, okay, thanks you guys. I'm going to go finish taking care of my kids because they're still kind of sickies right now. They've been sick all week and... We'll see how it goes. And yeah, so thanks for watching. Go over there and thumbs up. And I will see you guys next time. Uh-oh. Here we go again. Get the button. Where's the button? We're playing. Where's the button? Did I? Oh, guess what I did? I think I closed that window out. Isn't this fun? Yeah. Let me see if I push this button if it'll help. Okay. I'll talk to you guys later.